the distance in meters that a ball can be thrown by pupils at a particular school follow a, follows a normal distribution with mean 35 and standard deviation 11.6 you have come across information make a note so mean is 35 standard deviation is 11.6 clear now find the probability that a randomly chosen pupil can throw a ball between 30 and 40 meters so you need to find the probability that a pupil can throw a ball between 30 and 40 meters see man you need probability between 30 and 40 so here it is let us say this is normal curve now area under the curve will give you the probability so here you need to find probability between 30 and 40 means let us say here it is 30 and here it is 40 this area is what you need to find out okay probability is nothing but area under the curve so you need area under the curve from 30 to 40 now how do we find it means c i will find out the entire area that is less than 40 understand this if i find less than 40 this entire area i will get from that i will remove area which area which is less this area i will remove from this entire thing if i remove this thing the result will be this particular area am i clear all the normal between sums we do in the same way first this entire probability from that remove this area we get the in between area that is probability okay now how do i represent it means c this is between 30 and 40 so 30 less than x less than 40 is nothing but this thing is entire on the left side of 40 so x less than 40 minus p of this is entire on the left side of 30 so x less than 30 Am I clear with this statement? Now, in any normal distribution question, we have to make use of this one. P of x less than n is nothing but phi of n minus mean by standard deviation. You have to check out for this inequality. If it is less than, only then this will get converted to phi clear now come over here here it is less than so i can apply this onto this one so that will become phi of 40 minus mean 35 by standard deviation 11.6 minus here also less than symbol so p will change to phi 30 minus mean 35 by 11.6 okay now phi of 40 minus 35 is 5 by 11.6 minus phi of 30 minus 35 is minus 5 by 11.6 okay now see man here it is phi of 5 by 11.6 minus now how do i make this negative to positive means by doing 1 minus 1 minus phi of 5 by 11.6 now open up the bracket 
सो आई गेट फाइव ऑफ फाइव बाई लेवन पॉइंट सिक्स माइनस वन माइनस ऑफ माइनस प्लस फाइव ऑफ फाइव बाई लेवन पॉइंट सिक्स नाव यू सी हियर दिस वन एंड दिस वन आर सेम सो दैट विल रिजल्ट इन टू टाइम्स टू टाइम्स ऑफ फाइव ऑफ फाइव बाई लेवन पॉइंट सिक्स माइनस वन क्लियर नेक्स्ट टू टाइम्स ऑफ फाइव ऑफ कैलकुलेट फाइव बाई लेवन पॉइंट सिक्स एंड टेक अप टू थ्री डेसिमल प्लेसेस यू शुड गेट इट टू बी जीरो पॉइंट फोर थ्री वन माइनस वन नाउ this value you have to get from normal distribution table if any doubts in using normal distribution table look at the playlist in the description so this value you should get it to be 0.3668 minus 1 now put this entire thing in the calculator you get the answer to be 0.334 is our answer is it clear for always between sums we follow this method 0.3334